how's everybody doing there today? So, uh, a couple things. One is uh, I got a haircut, um, and uh, I don't know. This is what it is, right? So, anyway, so we're down here in San Miguel. I'm staying at the uh, San Miguel RV Park. Really great place. I stayed here before. I don't know if you can see that. So, it's on iOverlander, um, which is uh, a really handy tool if you haven't heard about it. Definitely look for the app uh, for, uh, um, for that. So, it helps you with camping, propane, mechanic parts, water, tourist attractions. It's really great. Um, so, anyway, kind of uh, uh, show you the, the park here a little bit, and uh, then we're going to move on. So this is uh, some of the vehicles that are uh, parked here. It's, uh, it's a campground and also a vehicle storage. Um, so um, it can uh, hold uh, about 12 vehicles. Um, and uh, in case you uh, wonder what the noise is, it's, uh, there's tennis courts on both sides of you. Um, so that's uh, it's pretty good. Uh, I'll just kind of show you the setup here, uh, what we got going on. So the last time I camped over here in this area, in this area here, which was pretty good. Um, this time, you know, we got the tent out here. Um, the car is all pretty much uh, set up here. So um, it's been it's been good. We've been here for about three days. They do have uh, they changed things from last time. So last time they had regular bathrooms, which I'll show you. And now they have solar. So uh, um, anyway, this is kind of the setup. We made some breakfast here. Since it was cloudy this morning, set up the uh, our own shower, which is this blue thing right. Here. So these were the um, older uh, bathrooms uh, for the RV park. Um, it's pretty uh, pretty nice setup there. So. So that's uh, what it used to be. And uh, they have new showers, which are over here. So these are the uh, new showers, which is in this building here. And you can see they've added a uh, solar hot water heating system. Um, you know, it's, uh, it is what it is. It works well. So there's a sink, uh, bathroom, standard bathroom. It's all brand new, so it's really clean, nice construction. There's uh, men's and women, and there's a, a shower. Um, so, a little shower curtain there, and uh, it's, it's pretty good. So, works well. Okay, so uh, the uh, first stop is the Labradoros del Choro. So what you can see behind me here, it's now a park. And then across the street, it used to be a church and now it's a restaurant. Um, but what these were, what these were, were public places where you could come and wash your clothes. So they would have this trough here would fill up with water. You would take your bucket and then you would put it in here. So you can see, like this one here has got a little bit of water in it. You can see how it's sloped. So you wash your clothes here, grind them, you know, clean them. And then you would uh, be able to wash your clothes. So it was uh, one of those things that was offered by the church. and. Um, it, uh, it's pretty nice, pretty nice area. So um, anyway, off to the next thing. So we're over here at the um, El Mirador. Um, it's pretty sunny out. It's a touristy spot and uh, 
You know, some of the COVID restrictions, it's a little baffling to me. Um, this is as close that we can get. We're about 20 feet away from the edge. But over there, you can see it, but there's trees. So it's like the best view you can't get close to. So subsequently, they have everybody standing on the street and you're in the way. So I'll flip it around. So this is kind of like the best view of San Miguel. You can see the uh, church off in the distance. Uh, I think that's like the view everybody comes here for, judging by the trees. So uh, yes, yes. So here's the, uh, the trees, but you can see here's the fence that goes around and doesn't let people get close to it. So I'll just uh, take another uh, closer view. So behind me is the uh, church of uh, San Miguel, and uh, we're going to go inside. Uh, there's a lot of people here, um, so we'll see how it goes. It's, uh, it's um, quite a busy day, so. So it's a really beautiful and impressive uh, church. Uh, it's where everybody, uh, it's the center of town. It's been this way for about hun hundreds of years. I think the church was built approximately 500 years ago. There's a sign over here. It says when it was built. Now this is, uh, 1784, but I think it's older than that, so. Here's the hours. So this is the uh, other side. These are the courtyard gates. And there's a really big uh, garden in the middle here, but um, with COVID, it's uh, closed. So you can uh, walk around the square and you can walk around the church, but uh, um, so we'll take a walk over there and we'll see what that's like. So, I think we're going to leave things here. We're going to continue wandering around the city and uh, seeing what we can find. Um, and I'll leave you with this departing shot and a couple thoughts. So here's the, uh, the church. And there's a really great square, of course, with COVID. Can't enter the square. They don't, they don't want people congregating, but... Uh, People congregate under the shade and the trees just fine. So the point is, uh, come and visit San Miguel. It's, uh, it's a great city. Um, lots of great people. Lots of great food. If you love croissants and coffee, this is the place to come.
Um, so I, there's always uh, somebody taking a photograph. There's always somebody making a video, flying a drone, something. So here's the uh, famous statue. And uh, get a little closer to it. And I just want to thank all my uh, subscribers, my new subscribers. Um, it's, uh, it's really great watching the channel grow. Um, I am working on making a recap video um, to kind of uh, let everybody know my story and why I started this trip and, and um, you know, kind of the, uh, the road ahead. So anyway, um, thanks for watching. And uh, if you like these videos, please comment, uh, share, subscribe, and click on those notification buttons for new videos. I try to upload at least once or twice a week, sometimes more, sometimes less. Depends what's going on. Um, so thanks again for watching. And uh, stay safe and stay warm.